guys, we're going to be unboxing this. Redmi 10. Why? What's the purpose? All right. As far as I can see, there is Apple, iPhones, and there's Samsung. And Xiaomi is the next highest company, at least where I am here in Europe. And you could spend $1,000 on getting last year's flagship S22, S21 and S21 uh, Samsung Galaxy S21. Or you can get almost the same specs in this phone here for 300 bucks. So we're going to unbox this and let you see what it looks like. Hey, the reason I chose to buy this is because about five years ago, I bought one of these. And I just bought it as a, you know, like a junk phone, right? I just thought, whatever. This thing did the very, very best uh, images using the selfie camera at night in a club that I of any phone I've ever had. So for some reason, the front facing camera did extremely good uh, images in the dark settings in a club. So most of the videos you see on my channel shot in a club with dancing, this phone here. I didn't care about it, so I'd bring it in case somebody stole it or whatever. Still working after all these years. So that's why I think it's good to check this out. Without the second hand, there we go, maybe. Okay, nice and clean inside, that's a good sign. It looks like instructions here. What the hell is this? Oh, it's a nice presentation. What's that say? Powered by Redmi. Okay, what the hell that means. So, <laughs> why not? All right, let's take a look. What's going on? It comes out like that. It's a nice presentation, I'll tell you. Lots of stuff. Comes with a charger. Hey, hey, hey. And the case. Let's see. Okay, we got the tool. And we got. Oh, look at this. Got a little case, even. All right, so let's take a look. Um, some of the things on here. It's supposed to have a 50 megapixel camera. Hmm. And it's a 6.5 inch screen. I'll let you know how big it actually feels. And uh, what else? I don't know what the hell that says. Can't read Russian very well. Big battery. A nice camera suite here. It's saying something about AI cam photography system. Hmm. So let's open it up. Hmm. Okay. So that's on the top, which I kind of like that, actually. There it goes. Redmi Android. Excellent. So, it's working. It does feel slick. It really does. Good response on the screen. So Xiaomi is actually an up-and-coming brand. And... You can see the phone is useful. What I like about it is it does have really a lot of memory, 125 gigabytes. Also gaming, it works pretty well. It, it really feels like my other phones, like my Galaxy phones. Um, the camera is not as good, to be honest. Uh, but you're going to see a camera comparison next. And that will show you the difference between the Xiaomi Redmi 10 and the Galaxy S9. Uh, I think the camera is sharper maybe slightly in the Xiaomi, but the Galaxy S9 has much better software. Uh, so, you know, but it is a useful phone and actually in your hands, it feels a lot like you're touching a flagship like an S9 or uh, an S, uh, a Galaxy Note 9, you know, something like that. It feels a lot like that. So it is a useful phone, and I think that they are making better and better phones. One thing I really do wish it had is 
a little bit larger screen. It does have the 6.5 inch screen, which is big and it's bigger than most phones, but it feels pretty much like an S9 in your hands. But I wish it had closer to a 7, like a 6.7 or a 7 inch.